Now there are two special series of elements that occur right after the transition element actinium and that is going to be the actinides so this is the actinides here and lanthanum called the lanthanides these special inner transition metals were first rearranged by Glenn Seaborg in the 1950s it caused quite a stir until it was pointed out and demonstrated that this arrangement seemed to predict the properties of the synthetic elements made by humans. This discovery has led to the most modern periodic table with its present shape. And here we see the King of Sweden giving a Nobel Prize to Glenn Seaborg for working with these synthetic elements. So he's the one that suggested that the elements in the inner transition should be pulled out of the periodic table and brought down here as two separate series. And now that is a good summary of how the periodic table has gotten to the